Okay, so what is up right now? I'm really excited because I'm gonna be decluttering my like foundation, primer, and concealer drawer. I really barely use any of the products in that drawer, so I feel like I should probably just get rid of some and pass them along to like my friends or family. So that's what we're gonna be decluttering today. So these are my primers, these are my foundations, and then I have like a packaging actually, so that goes in the past pile. Um, and then we have this right here, which is more foundation, and then we have all the concealers right here. So let's start with the primers because that's the first thing I would apply to my face in here. We have this um, Glam Glow Glow Starter. This thing I remember was like $56. I remember paying a lot for this thing. Um, but honestly, like it's really not that great of a product. I feel like Ah, gosh, what should I do? I'm not gonna, I'm gonna pass it. You know what, it's just, it's not that great of a product and I just don't need it. Um, then we have the Hourglass Mineral Veil Primer. I really actually like this. This has a little SPF in it. And uh, if I do use a primer, this is definitely one I will use. Um, and yeah, I really do like it. Then we have this Fresh Face Insta Glow Illuminizer. So it's like a super hydrating primer. And I actually do really like this. I feel like this is a nice overall hydrator. Um, and then, okay, I feel like there's some products in here I definitely don't need. This is the Touche La... No, no, wait. Let me say this correctly. The YSL Touche Club Blur Primer. Something like that. I am going to keep this because that's like... It's YSL. Why not? Um, and then I have this product from 100% um, Pure. I'm going to pass it. It's the Luminous Primer. And then I have this little Makeup Forever HD Primer. A little um, Urban Decay Primer. I have a lot of primers in here. Well, duh, that's my primer little section. Uh, then I have a uh, Moisturizer SPF, so I'm going to keep that. And then this um, Elf Blur Primer, which I will be keeping. So I feel like that was like 50% I'm keeping and 50% not. So that's pretty good. Okay, so next I'm gonna go into the foundation section. Um, I'm gonna keep my L'Oreal Lumi because I do really like this. Um, I have my It CC Cream, which I also like a lot. Um, this foundation right here, which I also like a lot. Um, they, these are the four that I really liked. And then we have this It Cosmetics um, Confidence in a Compact, which I also will keep. Um, but this is the drawer that I'm like, ah, I don't think I'm gonna keep a lot of this stuff. I have the uh, Tarte Rainforest of the Sea foundation. I'm gonna pass that along. It's just, it's not really that special overall, and there is coconut oil in it, so that breaks me out, which is not a good thing. Um, then I have these little NYX Total Control Drops. Um, I do like these for like, kind of making colors, like different colors for me, but like honestly, I'm not really using them, so I'm gonna pass them along. Uh, then I have this Makeup Forever Water Blend Foundation. Ooh, I feel like I'm gonna keep this because it's Makeup Forever and I just, uh, I feel like I have to in a way. I don't know why I have like a connection to it. Um, and then this 100% Pure White Peach little um, concealer. I think it's actually like a foundation concealer. I don't know. It's a little too like thick and full coverage for my liking. So I am going to pass that. Then I have a little Makeup Forever Ultra HD. Blah, blah, blah. And then I have this Makeup Forever Ultra HD um, foundation which I will be passing to. Ah, okay, and then we have the Milani Conceal and Perfect Foundation. Oh, I always used to love this thing. Oh, I feel like, mm, 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 I feel like I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it. I'm keeping it, I guess. <laughs> and then I have this like little uh, tiny sample of this Tarte um, like sunblock like tinted BB cream. So I'm gonna pass that. Okay, then we have like concealer. Oh no, actually there's another foundation. Fiona Styles foundation, I'm gonna pass this. I used to be like literally obsessed with that, but uh, I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna set these drawers down right now because like I don't really wanna like have to like work around them. Okay, here we go. And then we have a whole of my um, concealers. At least I think these are all concealers, yeah. Gosh, oh my gosh, I feel like this is such a throwback. There's so many products in here that I like forgot about. This is actually an exfoliator, so I'm gonna pass that. I do not need that in here. Um, okay, let's see. Let's divide it and conquer. So, I love the Tarte Shape Tape, so I'm gonna keep, should I keep these two shades? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep them both because I love the Tarte Shape Tape. I'm gonna keep my Instant Age Rewind Concealer from Maybelline, because I really like that. My CoverGirl Outlast. This No BB Cream Concealer. And, ooh, what else should I keep? And I'll also keep this Wet n Wild concealer. So all these I am going to pass. So the Tarte Maracuja, this like um, camouflage concealer, this Tarte concealer, um, these color correctors from Amazing Cosmetics. Um, yeah, I'm just not really into any of these products very much. So I'm going to pass those. So I definitely feel like I'm getting rid of more things than I'm keeping. So that is good. I'm gonna organize this and I'll be back. 
This already looks just like 20 times better. So thank you so much for helping me declutter and bye.